The official Hasbro Beyblade X app has just released, and to this point, we haven't seen anything about the app. So this is kind of my first time seeing it as well. All right, let's go on to the app. Beyblade X, it's loading. This is version 1.0 out of a bunch of different versions they're going to do. All right, so here we go. All right, I've already made my character. I put in my own, like, name, I guess. But besides that, I haven't done literally anything. So there's the battle tab. So Battle League is coming soon. That was something that was in the Beyblade Burst app. So that's going to be dropping at some point. Quick battle, but we'll look at that later. Here is our little collection. Um, they give us Sword Dran. So I wonder what happens if you scan Sword Dran. But there's the attack types. Beasts of Beyblade collection, the Beginner's collection, uh, Blazing Red collection. So this looks like all the bays that are in Wave 1. I don't see any Claw Leon or anything, but we see a couple Dronzers, uh, Arrow Wizard, Chain Incendio. So all the Wave 1 stuff. And there's a little QR thing. So let's actually scan a Beyblade for the first time. Let's go ahead and take apart Scythe Incendio. All right, here we go. We're scanning... That was, oh, there we go. We have the bay in the app. Definitely a lot quicker than the Hasbro app or the Burst app, I thought. But we just got Scythe Incendio, just like that. Charge. I, I don't know what to do here. What is this mini game? Are we doing a little max heavy attack? Okay. I... We got a burst finish. All right, so there's a little game whenever you unlock the bay. What are all... Diamond Impact. What are all these things? I think we need to do a tutorial, to be honest. But there we go. Now we have both Scythe Incendio and Sword Dran as part of our collection. What happens if we scan Sword Dran even though we have it? Let's try that. Okay, scanned. There it is. In Sword Dran unlocked. Even though we already have Sword Dran... It's interesting. Okay, this is a different type of charge here. I'm definitely kind of confused with what's going on in the app right now, but it looks cool. It definitely looks cool. Fireball. Flame Geyser. Okay, so are they different skills? There's actually a battle pass, it looks like. We are in a season reward. Collects. We got Boulder Rain. Mystic Spikes, Fireball. I guess these are like skills. Scorched Blade. And at the very end, you get a Toxic Power Core. Even though this video is about the Hasbro X app, definitely go and check out sponsor the channel, Mall of Toys. They have the upcoming Vice Tiger up for pre-order, and they have some of the older X bays like Shinobi Shadow, Tyranno B, and more up for sale right now. So go and check them out. Link in the description down below. And make sure you use code Illinook to get 5% off of your first purchase. There we go. How to play. Click. You gotta figure out how this works. So... Check out your Bay Locker. This is where you keep track of each Beyblade X product in your virtual collection. Okay. Uh, add products to your virtual collection by scanning the code. We already did that. Here we can select our Bay. You can see your Beyblade strengths and weaknesses. So we have attack, defense, stamina, and burst. Okay, typical. And you can change out parts, of course. Here we go. Each Beyblade has a power core loadout that accompany it into battle add power cores to launch power attacks and massive attack combos so that's what we didn't really know anything about okay that's what will be unlocked like that mystic rain or whatever that thing was power cores are used for attack and defense using a power core in battle gives it xp level up power cores uh, duplicate power cores the better the power core the better it is let me just swipe it in. You can have more than three of the same type. Okay. All right, let's just try out our first battle. All right, we already unlocked a level three. I saw a gold level three. All right, Sword Dran versus Horn Rhino. Swipe to start. Oh, this is different. You have to swipe it. Great launch. So here we are. We're adding to our power core. Can we do this one? Heavy attack, good impact on Horn Rhino. Gotta get used to that name. Max heavy attack. 
Okay, so as you charge, it builds up the power on the lowest core up to the highest core. And you want to try and do... So if you get... If you activate the top one, it'll do all three of them and get like a combo going. That's cool. That is... That's cool. That's interesting. It's definitely different than the Burst app. It has its similarities, but this whole loadout system is definitely more unique. It kind of makes it like an RPG. Well, there's the red drones or spiral. That's kind of cool to see that. But there's sound effects and whatnot. Let's check out the locker again. Let's go into Sword Dran. Oh, that's cool. At the bottom, there's a win ratio. That's kind of cool, actually. Uh, but here we have our tier three Scorched Blade. So we want that. How do we apply that? Let's put that here. Boom. And we want to put this level two one right there so we're all stacked now now we have our level three and you can have multiple configurations we can change up the parts although we only have a couple of parts right now so we're not going to really change anything up you know what let's scan again we're going to scan dagger dran just because i feel like it here we go so now we have more parts we have dagger dran we have rush rush might be a good part i don't even know is there going to be a beyblade app Meta? How does that even work? Charge. Max heavy attack. One impact burst. I will say, we've battled a couple of times, and we haven't seen any extreme finishes yet, which is interesting. Um, but let's go ahead and battle. Okay. We're going to do a quick battle. So there's online, there's battle of friend and random opponent already. So if you guys want to see me battle some other Beyblade YouTubers or even battle some of you guys, let me know in the comments down below. But we're going to do an exhibition battle, a uh, random opponent. I don't want to use Dagger Dran. Yeah, let's use Sword Dran. That's the one that has the upgrades that we like. See, the golden and silver or whatever. Basic, oh, I skipped through that. But there are different stadiums. There is a basic base stadium there, which is pretty interesting. So here we are up against the uh, EU Dronzer Spiral. Here we got a swipe. Great launch. No sound effect there is interesting. There's no like launching sound effects, which I'm not the biggest fan of. Okay, let's do... Can we do this one? Okay, well, let's, do, let's do our three power one. Medium attack. That was cool. That was a cool little visual effect. That was cool. Medium damage. I wonder if the top two are kind of linked together. Okay, so he got two going. I got one. Rocks. Okay, rocks fell on me from the stadium, I guess. So we can kind of cheat it, sort of, and do multiple charges at once. It's taking me forever to heat this up, though. Max heavy attack. Oh, he's almost dead. He's almost gone. Here's our silver. Okay, well, there's a spin finish right there. I want to be able to get to a burst finish. I want to get those extra points. I want to see an extreme finish. That's kind of the whole gimmick for this entire series. So maybe that's one of the orb... Oh, too weak. Oops. Maybe that's one of, like, the power cores that I need. One of them is an extreme finish, maybe? So we're going to wait to charge literally everything up. Uh-oh. He did a three. A three. Accelerator rail? What? Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't think I did it right. Oh. That was an insta loss. Of course, dude. The first time we see an extreme finish or an accelerator finish, it's an instant loss. Wow. Okay, we're going to rematch. We got to rematch that. That was crazy. I want to do an extreme finish. We are waiting. We haven't done anything yet. We're saving up. We are saving up and we're, we're hurting. We're hurting. Can I do this one? Okay, we'll go with the bottom. We'll go with the two. That's fine. Max heavy attack. There we go. Okay. That's going to be a spin finish. I'll take that. Maybe our Sword Drandis isn't high enough level for it yet. 
Okay, launching is hard. Launching is definitely way harder in the X app versus burst, I think. Light defense. Rocks fall on me. So that's definitely one of the effects of the power cores or whatever. Okay, so we'll do two. We'll do our silver one, which we just unlocked. Medium attack. Okay. Super heavy attack, but no extreme. No extreme, which is kind of interesting. So these two are locked together in a combo. Light defense. I think we got this. I, I think we win this. Or maybe not. Come on. Okay, we gotta go for the combo. We're, we don't have time. We gotta go for the combo. Oh, accelerator! Oh my god! Oh. What, ha what happened? I didn't get to do the accelerator. Well, round three. Here we go. Okay, here we have a combo. All three. Maybe the accelerator is just kind of random chance. Ooh, medium damage. We have one more, though. We have our gold, right? Yep, we have our gold. Oh. All that just for a spin finish? Seriously? Okay. The animations are definitely pretty cool. I wish there was more... Ugh, it's fine as a fine launch, I guess. I wish there was more, like, sound effects, like whenever you launch the bay, but there's really none of that. Max heavy attack. Yeah, just wait until we have actual, like, meta combos and meta cores to use and whatnot. It's kind of like a RPG, sort of. Oh, I didn't really activate anything. Oh, they've got a combo here. But it's definitely cool, because in the burst one, you had your parts, and they had their own, like, season gimmicks. But we didn't have, like, cores like this to really build up your own kind of loadout, sort of, which I think is cool. Okay, here we have our combo. Four. All right, so... No burst finishes that time, but we leveled up some of our cores. Um, reached increase. Yeah, we got to increase attack, of course. You can level up your power cores. That is really, really cool. That's awesome. That's awesome. I wonder if we could do a random opponent online and see if we actually go up against somebody. Like, is anybody playing on this app yet on the first day that it released? I don't think so. Oh, there is. White Blade number one, the first ever White Blade. That's crazy. I'm Superior Aura 2, but we're both using Sword Dran. This is the first online battle, okay? So this will be interesting no matter what. Hopefully it loads. What if it doesn't load? Maybe I shouldn't have said that. We're on a bit of a loading screen right now. Oh, here we go. Finally. Uh, uh oh, definitely. I don't know if it's my connection or theirs, or if maybe the servers aren't really working yet. Oh, here we go. Great launch. Yeah. So there's no like sound effects there, which is just kind of weird. Why can't I do my, oh, this is, this is kind of broken guys. This is, there's something wrong. As you can see, it's definitely kind of, okay, we're charging again. Can I do any of my moves? Yeah, this is unplayable. So I'm going to have to forfeit this. Kind of a, kind of unfortunate. That is the official Beyblade X app. Um, there's definitely some issues with it. Some of the animations I think could get fixed up. They of course need to add the Battle League. Um, only a couple examples of the accelerator rail, but I just could just not know how to do that. But overall, it's definitely pretty promising. Um, I hope they fix up some of those weird issues or whatever, add some sound effects to launches and whatnot, but it definitely has a stronger start than the Beyblade Burst app did. So I like it a lot so far, and I'm just gonna keep seeing what happens with the app, I guess. But that is going to wrap up this video. If you liked it, hit the like button down below. 
and hit subscribe to join the Nook Nation and let me know what app content you guys want to see next in the comments down below. But I'll see you in the next one. Have fun and bay away.